I would pour myself two bowls and I would take all the marshmallows for one, from one bowl and add it to the second. And then I would put the other ones down the garbage disposal. <laughs> Oh, sugar smacks is that a cereal is that was that a frog I can pick it's so funny you can like picture the like box you know okay let's talk Susan Graver <laughs> we've got a weekend plaid knit corduroy button front tunic shirt and I can't wait to hear what Beth Chandler has to say not only about the shirt but favorite cereal um under $50 okay $77 look how gorgeous this is now it's a knit corduroy which means it gives you that like micro welt of a corduroy but it has the fluidity of a velvet or almost like a soft velour and then the stretch that you know and love and it's mixing prints you've got plaid and an animal print all monochromatic right here is the hunter green she's fabulous and then we also have the burgundy really fun the burgundy and then take a look at my blue this one's indigo i do have a couple other colors i believe we still have the chocolate and the black so here's a look at that black now chocolate it's only in 3x and petite which leads me to my next point in black is also last call. This is a tunic shirt that is available in regular and petite. So I'm checking to see what I'm wearing. Just the regular. Okay. I know I get a lot of questions actually on um, my Instagram page, Ali Car QVC, as well as Facebook. I got questions yesterday in a live stream. I need more tops that are petite. Well, Susan does that a lot. Look how cute this is. Um, is Beth Chandler with us? Oh, sweet Beth. This is oh so fall, but like the the bit of cool that Susan always brings us. Look how cute. Right? I know, so cute. This is the best of fall. Um, so first of all, I have to say, super cute to look at. Obviously, we're getting this amazing plaid print and then made more feminine and modern and fresh with the addition of this little animal print pop like up at the collar. Sorry, my earbud was falling out. On the back yoke, at mm -hmm. the cuffs. Just something really cool. unique and special. This is not like your husband's corduroy shirt or something. Mm -mm. But I do have to call out the fabric. I was lucky enough to participate in an in-person customer event at QVC this past weekend. I got to meet a lot of Graver girls. So and they had some of it was so much fun and some of Susan's designs were hanging on the rack including another style of corduroy shirt and I had more than one customer say to me oh when they finally felt the fabric they were like you know what I would have passed that by just looking at it even though oh, it's cute thinking that it's it. like a stiff corduroy you have to feel it right. it feels like velvet with so much stretch it is so soft so drapey and luxe as you're throwing it in the washing machine and dryer but it is technically a corduroy because you have that what they call the, pin whale mm -hmm. so you're getting the very fine whale in here but the silhouette's awesome it's a snap front also it's not a button front so really great and easy if you yeah, have dexterity point. issues or if you just like i love how ali you just popped it on over another top yeah like, a, like little a little shirt, shirt jacket, jacket. exactly and it is true to size so i know you're in the regular length but it's not super long or overwhelming. I, it depends right. on your personal preference. I think so too. I'm 5'1". Um, you know, of course, I, I went to the doctor's office today and they measured me and I was like, hey, still hanging in at 5'1". But she measured me in inches and then I didn't catch it. So I was like, how tall am I? So I still, <laughs> I almost like want to go back and like, could I just get re-measured, please? <laughs> Did you lose height? Do you know how many inches? Well, I don't, I, I thought she, see, okay, I thought she said 62 and a half. And then I, you know, converted it in my phone. And then that said I was 5'2 oh. and a half. And I was yeah, like, five, two and a half. I'm not 5'2 and a half. <laughs> so I either, Maybe. you know, it, some, I was yeah. like, I'm not 5'2 and a half. Okay. You had a big hair day. Let me show you I've the colors. I've already lost an inch, so whatever. See, yeah. it happens. I love, it happens. I but, love the colors and it's something fun and fresh and you will right. adore this fabric. You will yeah. love it. And you machine wash tumble dry so it's not fussy, but it feels like a velvet. So when the friend sends you that text and says, hey, do you, you want to go run to the orchard with me? They've got their, you know, they got their market open and I want to go get that, you know, Vidalia onion dressing that's just so good. This is what you put on because you're just yeah. gonna throw it on with your jeans, but it feels so right for fall because of the mix of plaid, and then you also have the animal print. But then if you're going out and it's maybe a girl's night, you're gonna go see a movie, you're gonna go try that new restaurant that opened in town, you throw on some silver or gold jewelry, you wear with like a black liquid knit pant, and now it feels 
a little dressy, but still so right for the season. Or you're prepping Thanksgiving dinner and it's a fun way to wear plaid around the holidays. So burgundy, hunter green, indigo. We also have black and chocolate. Beth, thank you so much, but hey, Beth is coming back. So Beth, cliffhanger, back. cliffhanger on the cereal. First of all, do okay. you like cereal? I do, okay. I love it. I'm gonna tell you right now, Captain Crunch. That's my number one. Captain Crunch, with the berries? Mm -hmm. With the, no, just regular, that's how I want. Uh, okay. But the berries sound good too, okay. I'm open. Thank you, Beth. <laughs> Thanks, Allie. My son likes the ones with the berries.